Lately, his rivals have taken to calling him and his views, especially when it comes to Iran, dangerous. I think, I think this wild goal to have another war in the name of defense is the dangerous thing. And we need a strong national defense, and we need to only go to war with a declaration of war. Nothing could be more dangerous than the comments that I, we I just heard. The fact is, his views on foreign policy. I think are stunningly dangerous. What we do know is that the world remains a very dangerous place. That's why it's imperative that our next commander in chief appreciates the level of dangerous activity that we have in the world today. Some of our opponents have labeled us, and I just want to talk about that for a minute. They call us dangerous. <laughs> and you know, in a way, we are to their empire. That's what we're dangerous to. And that's why Ron Paul would make a very dangerous president. We're dangerous to the special interests and the big spenders, the people who want to run our lives. They want to police the world and spend us into bankruptcy, and they think they know how to manage the economy. We're going to change that. They're in danger of getting routed from the system. And that's why Ron Paul would make a very dangerous president. But they know darn well that I will stick to my guns if put in that office and protect the Constitution and liberty. Thank you. And that's why Ron Paul would make a very dangerous president. To their empire, that's what we're dangerous to.